sports coverage of the NBA playoffs leads us to game four of this year's NBA Finals. We're ready for tip-off, and these fans are as well. It's their home team taking on the Sacramento Kings. With Jay Williams, I'm Ed Cohen. Jay, you look at the Kings as they come into play. They lead this finals three games tonight, and the big win in game three means they can win it all here tonight on the road in game four. And the big thing right here is to not think about getting it back to your place. You want to win this game right here and right now. Don't extend this series. The Kings have built a comfortable lead. It was their playmaking, the way they gave each other scoring opportunities. That really impresses me. I love seeing unselfish basketball like that. These are the guys getting buckets for the Sacramento Kings. The 76ers may be in the building, but they did not show up for this game. The way they struggle doesn't bode well for them at all. But if they got some fight in them, we'll know right away in the third quarter. These are the guys getting buckets for the Philadelphia 76ers. Game track. Assists. What you see on screen is how this team was able to game its competitive advantage. Doing what's necessary for the league. Player of the half. I'm ready to skip ahead and just get this guy player of the game. You can tell he's on his way to a special game. We have picked them for you. Here are the top plays. Number two. I'm sending it back to Ed and Jay to bring you the rest of the game. Kings who get the victory. Capping off a dream season. They've captured their first NBA title since 1995. For my partner Jay Williams and our entire crew, I'm Ed Cohen. This has been the NBA Playoffs on EA Sports. Find out more at easports.com. Until next time, good night. time for the EA Sports post-game wrap-up. The Kings have earned what so many others have only been able to dream about, an NBA title. They've earned their place in the history books. Check out the leading scores for the Sacramento Kings. The 76ers are experiencing the kind of disappointment that can't be shared by anyone but a teammate. It's pretty quiet in their locker room right now. I can only imagine how tough it must be. Check out the leading scores for the Philadelphia 76ers. Game track. Assist. As you can see in the highlights, this team did a great job of staying competitive and putting in the necessary effort to get the win. Player of the game.
top plays, and we've got three of them for you. Number two. Number one. That's another postseason in the books, and I'm already dreading the wait for more hoops. See you next season. NBA champions. It's always a thrill when you can go home having claimed the crown, but it's even better when you're a rookie and you handed your business and walked home with the Larry O'Brien trophy. You know, I told you at the start of the season that I thought he had it in him to go all the way. Oh, you did? I did. I remember saying that. Oh, right. really? I remember you saying just a week ago that this was something you weren't sure he could do? I don't remember what I said a week ago, but I know what I meant. No, uh, no, -uh, -uh, I don't even try. I don't even try to claim that. I was behind the one 100% of the time. You, on the other hand, were a doubter. Bottom line, the work, the determination, the skill set that this brother brought to the table. I knew he was a rookie who could accomplish the impossible. I've been very impressed throughout these playoffs, not only with his play on the court, you could see that, but you could see the work he and the coaches have put in, the adjustments made, they made on the fly. It's just very impressive. I believe you now. Just don't come to me acting like you believed in them all along because we know better. Well, true believer or not, you can't deny he's an NBA champion. You know now. it'll be interesting, very interesting, I might add, to see how he takes this and parlays it into another championship. Oh, you think he's going to do it again? See right there? See right there? Right there what I'm talking about. The doubt in your voice sifting through that esophagus. I'm telling you, don't even try it. You're still a doubter. I would characterize myself as cautiously optimistic. Mm-hmm. I'm looking forward to having this conversation with you again in 12 months when he probably is going to walk home with another championship. We'll see. We'll see.
Thank you. 